than the Republicans. There you go. <laughs> Speaking of that, I got a letter from home yesterday. I got it right next to my heart. <laughs> you all know my folks, don't you? Yeah, we had a good time back there. <laughs> it says, Dear Nevada Jim, that's what Mama calls me. Things have been fine here in Rattlesnake Gulch, except today the police arrested your brother for making some big money. It was a quarter inch too big. <laughs> Elsie Crack finally found a way to keep her husband from biting his nails. She hid his teeth. <laughs> Clara Kimball Moose died at the age of 104. We saved the baby, though. <laughs> Clara was a beautiful woman back when she was young. Her husband couldn't keep his hands off of her, so we fired him and bought a tractor. <laughs> <laughs> Last week was Uncle Jeb and Aunt Martha's 50th wedding anniversary. Martha thought she would fix up a nice supper, so she told Jeb, we've been married for 50 years. Go out back and kill the chicken. Jeff said, why take it out on a chicken for something that happened 50 years ago? <laughs> you remember Willard Gunn? My, he was a lazy man. His wife said he finally did his first honest day's work on the day he died. She had him cremated. Put him in an hour box. Used him to, used him to tie the eggs. Oh, jeez. She always said on his best day he was only good for three minutes. <laughs> well, I must go help your father. He was sleeping and when he rolled over, his nose got stuck in his ear. He sneezed and almost blew his brains out. Thank <laughs> you. 